New York Congressman Brandon Williams is one of the many leaders calling for unity amongst all parties. He shared his thoughts on the events that took place on Saturday at Trump's rally with our Morgan Scott. Congressman Brandon Williams tells me he is devastated by what took place at that rally, and he's adamant that those actions do not reflect what this country stands for. After having his own experience of receiving death threats to his family, Representative Williams says violent rhetoric in politics does not come as a shock to him anymore. But with an assassination attempt on former President Trump, there is far more concern about what we are living through today. We all should be alarmed. Uh, our country is not uh, made for this. This is not who we are as a people. And uh, we got to you know, take this uh, level of political dialogue uh, and the rhetoric, particularly the violent rhetoric, and, and take it down several notches. Before Saturday's attempted assassination, there have been at least a dozen instances of political violence targeting U.S. presidents, former presidents, and major party presidential candidates. The last time something this serious has happened was more than 40 years ago. There's uh, just disbelief. Uh, that this that this could happen today. I was 13 years old when Ronald Reagan was shot. This is far and away the most serious uh, crisis in terms of a, an assassination attempt uh, in uh, you know since 1981. As more details surrounding what happened are sorted out, Congressman Williams says the Republican Party will keep looking for answers. Uh, I would say that uh, every Republican member of Congress is deeply concerned about what this means for our country. Uh, they're concerned about the uh, protection of President Trump uh, and that he has the resources to be protected. Uh, they're concerned about the actions of the Secret Service yesterday. Uh, so we're anxious to get an investigation underway as to how this could happen and how this was allowed to happen. Moving forward, Representative Williams says he is hoping for a huge shift from the irresponsible rhetoric, which has been thrown out from all sides during this presidential race. Reporting in the control room, I'm Morgan Scott. And for more information on this story and for breaking updates, you can head to our website at cnycentral.com.